Hey, hey, everybody. Welcome back to another Double D video. I'm not going to say quick reviews because this one might be a long one. I was at the local Tuesday morning. As you know, you get cheap stuff in there. And what did I come across? Boom. The G.I. Joe Cobra Rattler construction set. Now, I admit it was cheap and I got it because I just I love that art. If you look down at what it's supposed to actually look like. It looks like shit. Excuse my language. But I also wanted the minifigure of the Commander and Destro and the two troopers. So, uh, what we're going to do today is something different. If I knew what I did with my... Ah, oh, there it is. We're going to pop this bad boy open and we're going to put it together and see what it looks like together. Take a look at the back of the box. Oh, I wish I would have seen the hiss. Big Hiss fan. A Cobra Ferret. I had one of those to my father. Ran it over in the car. Cobra Fang. Night. That looks nothing like a Night Raven. But then again, this looks nothing like a Rattler. And let's get it open and take a look. Like usual, I am digging this box art. Whoops. Now I'm tearing the box because I'm an idiot. Now it's taped up top. And down bottom. Now, hopefully this video goes well. It's not my only Lego set I'd like to put together. I, I have the Rick and Morty garage I'd like to put together. And what the hell is going on in here? Jeez. There we go. Finally. I'll check inside the box. Nothing else in there. Oh, this is, this is ugly. A lot more curb wood for the recycling. We have bags. And here's a bunch of people parts. Oh, this, this is a lot of blue. We might be doing this differently than I thought. Oh, look at these instructions. Well, this looks this looks incredibly complicated and stickers oh that is not good I suck at stickers more parts okay we're going to be doing this a little bit differently we are now going to Stop the video. I'm going to build this and we'll come back and look at it then. Because, frankly, I expected a little longer video. But this is so much blue. So, hold on to your horses. Go get a drink and uh, we'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. I have to talk a little soft because now it's after midnight. Because it took me that freaking long to finish this thing. Okay. Okay, this is what it looks like. All said and done. Honestly, it looks like crap. And the figures which, by the way, were incredibly hard to put together. Let's just lay them down and get a better view of them. They don't look so good either. As I said, I have to be a little quiet because everybody in the building is asleep right now. Well, mostly. Saturday night, maybe they're not all asleep. Sorry about that. But my significant other is, so I have to be a little quiet. Now this box sucks. Now if this was like a um, a knockoff, I'd understand that. And I definitely would not pay full price for this. 
says compatible with other brands. Most of the bricks have this unfinished feel about them. They got little bits that I feel like I should trim off an exacto knife. Like you can see one right there. I doubt you can actually see it, but it's there. And it looks like crap. It's not see. Parts falling off. The figures. Yeah. If I paid full price for this, I would be very unhappy. And then the instructions were overly complicated. And if you go like see pieces keep falling off. You just touch it, the whole thing just starts falling apart. This if this is a Hasbro official piece, they could do so much better. This is crap. My grandson puts together Legos all the time. I know these are construction sets, but his they can do planes. They don't have to have that. This thing is junk. Now, I do like the box art. I've already said that. And I had a feeling that the thing wouldn't be too pretty when I saw the box art picture on the box. But there's even a limit to my patience. And this thing, hell, I don't even know how to put it back together again. Yeah, it just feels wrong. Yeah, I'm not even gonna try anymore. It's junk. Oh crap, oh no wonder I was putting it on backwards. But that's not important. It's junk. My advice, don't buy this. Not unless you really want to waste your money on something that... Honestly, just don't buy it. You'll, you'll be much happier. See the... Looks nothing like a Warhog or even the Rat Order like on the box. And it's such cheap quality, it's, it's falling apart as I'm touching it. I'll probably keep the little mini figures, even though they don't look so good, but look good enough for me. And I'll give this to my grandson to take apart and use on some of his other Lego sets if it'll work. I don't have to take a knife and trim all the extra little bits off from everything. And, anyways, that's enough ranting for me. Do I recommend this product? Uh, let me think. Um, no. I was going to try to find the other ones, but after seeing this, just straight up, no. And I hope I just saved someone some money. Uh, anyways, please like and share and subscribe if you would. And uh, it's after midnight now, close to 1230, so I'm going to get some sleep. And y'all have a good night. Double D.